Just realized I didn't show you guys the money here. I have a Zoom meeting with an agency in LA, so we'll see how it goes. All right, so I'm gonna go out looking like this. I washed my hair already with the Aveda Brilliant Shampoo and Conditioner. Actually, I'm gonna throw on a hat. Again, I'm a hat. I got this hat from a place here in Cape Town called Woolworths, but let me go catch my Uber and let's head over to Scar. So my agency actually referred me to the salon um, the first week that I arrived and when I went to them they were just so sweet and nice and they did a great job. I wanted to come back to make sure I filmed the process with you all. I'm going to be trying out other salons for you guys especially when I get my weave taken out. I definitely recommend the salon especially if you have extensions or are trying to get extensions because that's something that they also do. They don't do sew-ins but he said they do tape ins. And the cost was 420 Rand for the blow dry and flat iron. I come with, there with my hair wash because I really just love my Veda shampoo and conditioner. I feel like it's just been adding so much shine to my hair. So make sure to have those linked down below. Here are the curls. I honestly love the way he rolls my hair. And you can even see with my leave out how straight he got it. He even got my edges straight. I'll make sure to leave Lotus's Instagram down below along with the salon's info down below. What's up, today is Tuesday and I had quite an eventful day today. It's about six o'clock. I've been running all around today and then I ran over to the beach and did a shoot. Um, so I have some like behind the scenes footage of that and then after that I had to run over to a casting and then me and my friend ate dinner at this Moroccan spot. I had this turmeric lemon ginger chicken sandwich. It was so good and now I'm going to do a little bit of editing and then at 8 o'clock I have a zoom meeting with an agency in LA so we'll see how it goes. Tomorrow won't be as busy but I do have some errands to run. I'll definitely let you guys know how this zoom meeting goes. What's up today is Thursday. I know I didn't vlog like yesterday probably the day before. But I've been out and about by myself and I just don't feel comfortable having a camera on me but I was supposed to have a shoot today they got canceled so I'm really like upset about it so my agency heard my raft today but anyway I'm just gonna go to this coffee shop called bootleggers and do some editing later I'm just gonna take some fashion like social media photos for Instagram and I really need to do laundry I need to clean up but just kind of make it today a chill day getting some work done organizing myself and just trying to hustle as much as I can network as much as I can I don't know if I mentioned this already but I worked basically three jobs back in the States and I feel like I'm working harder here, working for myself than I did back at home. And because today is Thursday, it marks my official two weeks of being here. And for anybody who's lived abroad kind of knows that you go through cycles of it being like full of bliss and excitement. I mean, usually at around the two week mark, that's when reality starts to hit. And then it can kind of mess with your emotions and just your bearing. So I'm at that point where it's starting to like come down a little bit and I'm starting to get frustrated, but I'm going to intentionally work on making sure that it goes back up and that I just try to stay on a lane of just gratitude and appreciation to even be here. Also, I had the meeting with LA last night. It went pretty well in my opinion, but what I've learned is just because an agency may offer you a contract doesn't mean that agency is the right fit for you. So when signing with an agency, you also have to make sure that they're of a benefit to you 
as much as you're a benefit to them. So if they offer me a contract, I'm going to look more heavily into seeing if it's something that I want to pursue. I'll definitely keep you guys updated. But yeah, that's the updates for now. Let's get back to work. Just realized I didn't show you guys the money here. The bills are so cool. They kind of remind me of the Euro. But on the front, they all have uh, Nelson Mandela. And then on the back, they have animals. I think their money is so fun. I love it. I'm definitely going to bring some of this back just as like souvenirs. Good morning, today is Friday and I have somewhat of a busy day. I need to run over to my agency now because my cop cards are ready and then I need to just go meet a photographer real quick to give her something and then I'm meeting a new model that I met through my agency for like a coffee just to talk and get a little bit more clarity about how the industry works out here and then I'm gonna run back home, get dressed and go to a casting later this evening. So let me get myself together and let's head out. Just got back from having brunch with my new friend. She is one of the sweetest, nicest people I've ever met. I will make sure to have her Instagram linked. Right now, I just um, changed, put on some fresh makeup, and I'm gonna head over to a casting. So let me throw on my shoes and let's get over there because I gotta make sure to be there on time. just made it back the casting went okay we'll see how it goes i'm believing god for a booking next week i am just going to take a shower wipe this makeup off my face i'm going to do a little cleaning i say that every time i get home and then i look at it i'm just like i'll do it tomorrow but i think i'm going to actually at least attempt to do the dishes i'm going to do some editing get this video out for you guys today i hope you guys enjoyed this one um i have some fun adventures planned up for the next couple of days so make sure you subscribe if you want to stay tuned and until the next video I want to thank me for doing all this hard work. <laughs>